Kura! Sorry. Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel, We're the Movie Couple. I'm Wendy. I'm Dustin. And we've got treats today to unbox. We've got... Treats, 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 treats. Really, treat, treat. it's called treats. So you guys, this is a treats uh, subscription service where you can pick in, pick and try international foods from all over. Um, mm -hmm. When we were offered this, they said you can have something from from Russia, from Germany, I think from Italy is one of them. And uh, I asked Dustin, what do you want? And he said Germany. So I said... Okay, so um, because we are doing this explore the world through, through food, food, what better way to explore the world? Very true. So you guys, if you are interested in trying to treat yourself, you can use the code the movie couple to get fifteen percent off on your very first subscription box, and just go to it. I'll link go ahead and link it down below for you. Just www.trytreats.com. Super easy, and we'll talk about it again at the end of the video. But I don't want to wait. I like food, so let's. Me too. Try some Germany treats. Okay, here we go. Oh, they a... can't see anything. <laughs> it's completely blocked with paper. But I mean, the packaging is nice. I always appreciate nice packaging. Mm -hmm. So I appreciate Oh, it looks that. like we have a lot of chips in there. Got a lot of um, fun facts. So they always have little posters. There is one of the castle in Germany. I'm not going to attempt to, to <laughs> say it because I'm going to say it wrong. We'll butcher the name. You guys it's... can see it. Yeah, I'll come a little bit closer. Focus. There we go. Germany tree. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, Germany facts. And on the back of it, how to make sautéed German sausages. Ooh. Uh, we're keeping this. <laughs> and also, this is the best part is this is a postcard that tells you exactly what you're going to be trying. So you're not going to be like, I don't I don't know what, what is this is. And you're just guessing. So let's just go down the list. The very oh, wow, first one. There's actually one, a lot of in, in oh, English Oh, I forgot on the to back. mention... There's a, a couple of different uh, levels. This is the premium box. Oh, okay. So we get a lot more items in this one. So starting off the very top of the list, we have the Salted Pump Sticks by Lorenz, which is this guy, I think. Did I almost smack you in the face? Almost. <laughs> it was like, I'm sorry. All right. Uh, so they look like pretzel sticks. Um, and they Where are, are the crunchy uh, baked potato sticks. Okay. No, we have to eat it at the same time. Oh, wow. We will eat it at the same time. So this is potatoes? Mine's broken. No. Oh. <laughs> Grab another one. There's plenty of them in there. Okay. You get about that many. Wait, can you get it yet? In Ready? three, two. Oh, tink. <laughs> they taste like pretzel sticks. They taste like, yeah, pretzel sticks. I mean, a pretzel sticks potato. The next thing we have is Curly, also by Lorenzo. Oh. So it's a corn snack covered in freshly ground peanuts. A corn snack? Covered in ground peanuts. Okay. It's crunchy in texture, savory taste, melts on your tongue. I like savory taste. So it looks like a Cheeto almost. I like Cheetos. Like a Cheetos puff. I want to smell it. Oh, it smells very peanut buttery. Hmm. You ready? Yeah. Three. Oh. Think. What happened to the countdown? <laughs> it's kind of, it's not that flavorful. I was expecting a lot more from the smell. From the smell, it's very peanut buttery. Oh, wait. Shoot. I messed up. I handed you the wrong thing. What do you mean? The first thing... I'm sorry, you guys. The first thing we tasted were the saltettes. Oh. And these are pretzels. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Sorry about that. So, now you know if you're still with us. Saltettes. Okay. All right. I'm so, the these are... Act these kind of taste like if you took... A Cheetos puff didn't have any of the Cheetos powder on it and just had um, like a light peanut butter kind of powder flavoring to it. I mean, it's not bad, but it's to me, it's a little. I mean, like, the more I eat, the more of the savory taste I get. Yeah. yeah we'll go back to the potato. How many of the viewers out there were like, those are saltettes? You guys read! We this can. is what happens when you're too excited to try food. Mm -hmm. Palmettes, and those certainly do look like potato sticks. Mm -hmm. That's Let's a good try. honor. I wonder if these are going to taste like, kind of like french fries in a sense. Oh, yeah, they look, they look like them. Potato sticks. They look like little potato sticks. <laughs> Hold on a second, let me show, I want to put a couple in. Uh, come on, focus. There we go, that's what they look like. Okay, here we go. In three, two, wait, tink. Mm. These are actually the way you normally like to get like your um my French fries. 
Anytime we go like to In and Out, when do you... can I get this in America? I would snack on this all day. Those are good. You guys ever put um, crushed potato chips or potato sticks on your hot dogs? Mm hmm. Very, very tasty. Those are my favorites so far. Yeah, out of the three tried. that we've had. Mm hmm. I feel like we got all the savory, salty stuff out of the way because mm -hmm. all the rest are candy. Oh, wow. That's a lot of. A lot of candy that's still left in there. Mm -hmm. mm. So what happens when you yeah. get the premium eat... box. This is the Rose Milk Chocolate by Hachez. Hache. <laughs> uh, so go ahead and show them what that looks like. And the, these are chocolate pieces with extremely smooth cocoa flavor. Um, established in 1890. And it's one of the world's largest processing locations for cocoa beans. Oh. Mm. That is really smooth chocolate. It is. Wow. And it's so, like really smooth and like really soft. Mm. It's not as potent in like sweetness. Like I was going to compare it for a second to like Godiva chocolate, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. this is a lot smoother, but and but a lot less of a kick of like sugary flavor. Yes, that's what I've noticed about which like, is actually really good. Like American chocolate versus like foreign chocolate. Crank up the sugar. Yeah, like, like, the next thing we have is called Leo by Milka. Oh, Leo, right there. Oh, they're like Kit Kats. They look like little Kit Kats. You can take a look at that. I will show them. You know. You are so close. That's too close. Look at it. It's focused. It's in their face. Oh, but it looks like they have little pieces, like little cream All layers right. in there. Um, Tasty wafer cookies layered with a delicious cream filling. Hey, hey. And covered in a thick coat of milk chocolate. Oops. Oh, so it's, it's um, supposed to satisfy your vanilla and chocolate cravings, similar to Kit Kats, but with a German twist. Hey, hey. All right. I like that. Hmm. Better than Kit Kats. I think I like these better than Kit Kats, yeah. yeah. You can't really taste the cream, but it's weird because you can kind of feel it because... It's in between the wafers, like a little The sandwich. wafers are like softer. It really gives it a much softer, it's like when a Kit Kat kind of is like a little bit harder. Mm -hmm. I like these. All right. Holy cow. We still got. We got Caramel so Waves by Milka. Caramel Waves. Is that it? Mm-hmm. All right. Let's open this thing up. So. Um, holy cow. This thing's like. It's a chocolate bar made with 100% Alpine and consisted of half milk chocolate and half white chocolate. Cool. Ooh. Sprinkle with caramel beans, making it an innovation on the traditional chocolate bar. Caramel beans? Caramel beans. Ooh. Caramel, caramel. Oh, wow, look at that. How do you say it? Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, hold on a second. Let me see if I can. Look at that. What, what are you doing? You got to show them the... I'm... Oh, you want to show them yeah. all of the caramel beans. Yeah. Ta-da. Okay, let's try this out. How... How do you do I, I feel yeah, like just I go just and take, put a um, bite there oh, here. and there? Well what we can do here, I'll just break a little piece off. Okay, here we go. Hmm. Not bad. Mm. I mean So milk chocolate isn't my favorite. Milk chocolate isn't your favorite? Just because it's it's the sweetest. Yeah. So I usually like to, on the other side of the spectrum, so I usually like to go white or dark. I mean, I'm not saying I hate it, because most chocolate treats are milk chocolate, and I like chocolate regardless, mm -hmm. so I eat it, but no, I, I kind of favor the white chocolate side. Oh, really? Because mm -hmm. I find the white chocolate to be a little bit sweeter. Mm -hmm. But here in America, white chocolate is usually a lot sweeter. But... So we have the perfect solution. We'll break it down the middle. You can have the milk chocolate side. And I'll eat the white chocolate <laughs> side. The next thing we have on the list is called the Roulette Papi Cola by Haribo. Haribo. I think these are the guys that do like... The um, gummies. The gummy bears. The gummies that I like. And it even has like the same kind of gummy bear on there. Yeah. Oh, so this is probably going to be like a soda gummy. Like a Coca-Cola. Like, like a, those, those bottle cap things, huh? Yeah. Everything, I've, I've always, I, I am like Germany, man. Your like candy game is strong. Mm-hmm. I like their, um, what is it called? Their snack game is strong. Yeah. I like all these. Little gummies. Okay, I'll oh. take, I'll take three, two, there. A little, like, little discs. Mm. 
These are really chewy. Like, I can, maybe I can you should taste, suck on them for a little bit. I can taste the Coke. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mmm. But you like those. Mm-mm. I don't Never mind. like it. It's a little bitter, and I don't know why. It's fizzy. Is it? Mine's not fizzing. A little bit. Unfortunately, not a fan. Lucky for us, there's tons more in here. Because <laughs> so we're going to move on to the next thing, which is called Choco Moo by, I think it's this, mm-hmm. Choco Moo by Milka. Cow-shaped cookies topped with a layer of milk chocolate, crunchy in texture, and lightly oh, sweet yeah. to the bite. Ooh, these might be really, really good. I'm excited for these. Because I have an idea of what these might taste like. Is there two of them? Perfect. There's three of them. Oh, we have to fight. We fight you for this. Or we can just split it. Oh, See, it's a cow. It's a cow. Mm-hmm. All oh right. Oh my gosh. We gotta move. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I had a feeling that it was going to taste this like wind. the wind. Mm. Oh my god, it's so good. I really like this. I like the way that the it's cookie so isn't buttery. Mm-hmm. That's what it is. It's a really buttery kind of cookie. And um, the milk just blends into it really, really well. By Milka. Oh. My God, it's so good. You know, I'm wondering if we can get these at, like, World Market. If so, we're buying the whole thing. Well, am I going to have to fight you for the other one? No, will split it. Yum. Mm-hmm. Definitely That's my a favorite win for so that far. one. Oh. I yep. like this. This is the next thing, and it's Bueno by Kinder. Kinder Eggs. Same, t- same oh, people. Kinder right. Eggs. So this is crispy chocolate-covered wafer bar with a rich hazelnut cream filling. Ooh. Wrapped in two individual plastic sleeves, so you can eat one and save the other for later. Excellent. So we'll just split one of them. And save the other. This is smart packaging when they... Mm-hmm. When they uh, so you don't sacrifice. Oh, look, and there's a little tabby. Oh. You can just... Ha-ha. Nice. One for you. Tink. <laughs> or squish. Oh, wow. Oh, man. That's like a hollow wafer. They put the good stuff on the bottom of the list. Oh, my God. Mmm. I really like that. Mmm. Mm. It is like... Oh, wait. If you've ever had like a cream puff, but then just make like the outside a little crunchy, like it's been kind of like toasted, and then have the it was really That's good. That's so good. Not as good as the cookie. Not as good as the choco move. I don't know. But oh, I don't know. I like that. That is. I will give you both of these for the cookie cow. So I get the rest of these. Yes. Okay. Deal. All right. We're going to move on to our final item. Chocolate bars by Kinder. So these are individually wrapped chocolate sticks with creamy milk filling. And yeah, um, we, we don't need a box now. It's empty. Individually wrapped. Mmm. Oh, these are good. Oh, look how smart. And they're just big, big of only three uh, on it. Milk filling, huh? Oh, okay. So it's kind of like... Um, chocolate and white chocolate milk. Like chocolate. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. I'd have to give that, yeah. It can kind of need something else in it, though. I do have to admit, like, having, like, a wafer in there or having something. Hey. They say if you're feeling adventurous, we recommend trying some of them frozen. You can freeze some of these. That might be a really good idea. I'm so excited. This was a really good box. I mean, nothing here. I was like, uh, well, maybe the... I didn't like the the gummies very much. The gummies were my least favorite. The Mm -hmm. chocolate cow cookie was my favorite. Mm -hmm. And then I would say, like, these I'm also obsessed with. Those are really good. And you know what? These, the peanut ones have actually kind of... They grow on you. They kind of grown on... Especially if you're having something sweet with them, it brings out their salty savory flavor a little bit Mm -hmm. more so but how about you guys i mean you saw us eating these which one do you think would be like oh that actually looks really good yeah and some of them you're like "Uh uh-uh i ain't trying that so you guys let us know in the comment section below what you think 
tasted the best, what you think you will like the most out of this box. And once again, if you want to subscribe to Treats and get one for yourself, make sure to use our code, The Movie Club. We get 15% off for your very first Treats box, and I'll link the, well, I'll link the link in the <laughs> comments in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Treats Box, for sending it over, and we'll see you in the next video.